Better meeting you out there. I didn't quite catch your handle, but 682 over here, man on the mountain, Mr. Weird Beard, a.k.a. Green Dog, and I'm back out. <laughs> For all you people out there that did not hear this conversation up here in my area, we have a, 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 a new operator on the air, and uh, he only has a flat side on and beam, and he might not be able to get down to where you folks are to get out of his way and skip land. Anyway, uh, we're going to start this so-called road call right now. I had an issue with my other radio. I had an issue with my recording device. But, alas, all is not in the shitter. Somebody came up here with a recording device. He parked behind me, and he's going to do all the recording tonight. And uh, I guess somebody's going to let me do some of the talking anyway. But anyway, fellas, I'm sorry that's the way it happened. But next time there is to be a roll call by me, I will be about 50 miles west of Harrisburg on top of a mountain. I've been here many times over the years. It'll be interesting to see who can get it back. But anyway, right now, good evening time. Quad State members and anybody else, Tonight is our roll call uh, here on Channel 20. I am the rear bear. Uh, I'm sitting at an elevation of about a thousand feet. We have an IMAX on top of my vehicle here, and I'm using a uh, Razor 2970 N2 tonight. And if there's anything else you'd like to know, clear it up. I hear you, Mr. Potato Head. I thank you for the company. And I know where you hide. Yeah, man, I know where you hide, too. You sound great tonight. Have a good one. I'll be back on the side. Thank you, young man. What are you doing there? You know, what about that rare bear? How about that rare bear? 723. She's down there on the uh, Northeast Extension, mile marker 33. Did you say that mobile? Uh, 723? What's your mile marker again? Mile marker 33 southbound on the northeast extension. I got mile marker 33 southbound on the northeast, okay. I guess you're heading down towards the Philadelphia area. You're going south anyway. Most of the people that I'm talking to this evening are south of where you are. Philadelphia, South Jersey, and it is the majority, but uh, we do uh, talk all over. So right now we are on roll, roll call, and uh, I'll be standing by for the next one. I hear that Moonraker One. I hear Moonraker Runs outside of the, the city of Brotherly Love, is it? Anyway, good evening time, number one. Prayer Bear, 926 in Williamstown checking in. 926 wide inside. Mr. 926 in the garden. Sounded superfluous as usual. Anything else would be totally uncivilized, right, Hudson? That, uh, that guy, what's his name? Rare Bear. That Rare Bear, he taught me well. And I'm off to you. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah. <laughs> don't be, don't be a thief now. <laughs>
Roger that. Uh, Hearthstone, real quick, tell me what this thing is giving you down there as far as signal-wise. Uh, tell me what, what, what my operation is here. He just took a five-minute pause for the cause. If anybody down there can hear me, we're live on Quad State. We're live on Quad State on the Facebook page. Yeah, I hear you live on Quad State. As a matter of fact, you sound like Star Wars. I am, sir. Good, uh, good evening. I didn't want to interfere. He's taking a five-minute break, but I didn't know if you fellas could hear me down there. It's tough receiving you guys this time around. I don't know what it is. Hey, Paul, where are you at? For what it's worth, I got about a five-pounder on you. A 1207-926 hard start set it, and I'm back what? Copy that, 926. Thank you, sir, and have a good evening. Let me take a standby, and when Rare Bear's ready, I'll be still recording. Hey, Paul, 1207. Where, where are you at? I'm up here with Rare Bear. Okay, where? <laughs> Off of Route 100. Ah, uh, yeah, well, we passed you then. I don't know. I was kind of waiting for the roll call to start. I don't know what was started. I'll go in and grab my phone in a couple of minutes, Sheriff Bullard. I'm sure, if you said it, I'm sure I got it. I just haven't picked my phone up yet. I'll see. He's not recording this. I'm going to be recording it, and then I'll take the video and save it down. I'll give it to him, and he can post it on YouTube. Well, so much for that. I tried. Once again, I got stepped on. Yeah, who's calling? Yeah, who's calling Star Wars? You got 751 here, uh, Bridgewater, New Jersey, waving a hand. 
Hello, 751 Bridgewater. You're making a good trip up here to Rare Bear Mountain. Copy that. Likewise. Sounding good tonight. 73rds, friends. I'm going to take a standby. When this gentleman comes back on, I don't want to hog the frequency. Copy that. Oh, dude. <laughs> I got it. I got it. 
I got what you said there for sure. All right, where's my friend Irene in Delaware? Is she copying the mail tonight? They call it 135, the hammer. Because he's not out there.
around here, but if you're from ready, you can drop their reply off to Kiwa Willie. Very good. Thank you for the thank you for the call there, chocolate chip cookie. And uh, I'm off the key. Who's next? See Ray, is that you? Oh, pretty good now. I have a, a weak copy on you, but you are clear. Does anybody from the club know for sure if Raggy is going to be on the air tonight out at his campsite about 40 miles northwest of Harrisburg? I guess not. Uh, yeah, go ahead, Breger. JC 300 Mobile, Philadelphia. Well, you made your trip, young man. How about that? carrier out there. Boat again? Yeah, 
As soon as he takes a break, guys, I'll walk over to his van and I'll, and I'll put him on camera. I'm the only one recording. He doesn't have his cassette deck with him tonight. So be patient. When he takes a break again, I'll walk over to the van. Yeah, you're giving me five or six bars. I suppose you rascal. 
because the last couple of times I spoke to you, uh, you were down and out. Your beam was down, you were on your, your uh, ground plane there, but the, the way your radio came into the RBC tonight, and your signal was way up at a half scale, I kind of figured you were on that beam. Copy that. Uh, thanks for the comeback. I'll be on the side sandbagging here. Good talking to you, Rare Bear. Okay, 751, a pleasure on this end also. And uh, after this roll call, I know you'll be hanging. Uh, point that beam. You pointed right at me. I'm west of you. You might want to point it uh, south, southwest and uh, get Hard Start down there. He's down at Williamstown, New Jersey. And there's a couple other stations down there with good antennas. Might be able to receive you any, uh, also. So, 751. For now, we're going to cap it up and uh, let somebody else rock. How about a rare bear or sledgehammer in Phoenixville? Sledgehammer in Phoenixville, wow! Yeah, are you kidding me? No, sir, I just want to wave a hand out there, 77, right back to you. Man! It's been a hell of a while since I heard you, man. You and a, you and one two seven all the time. Every once in a while, you come out of the woodwork. It's so good to hear you, man. You always got a choice sound and uh, signal there. Yeah, you're the same, brother. You keep up the good work, man. I appreciate everything you do, man. Take care. Well, a pleasure talking to Sledgehammer. 77 out of Phoenix, though. walk over and say hi to him. Here we go. Can't see my antenna right now, but you can see the sky. I'll go over and say hi to him, since everybody wants me to show Rare Bear. I'll let you see what Rare Bear's running. I don't know if I can put a light on. Ah, there we go. Alright, guys. We are here, behind Rare Bear's van. And this is what Mr. Rare Bear is running tonight. And I'll shut the light off and I will now approach Mr. Rare Bear because his Facebook audience wants to see him. No, you don't either. I no. told you about this. All right. No filming. No filming. Okay. He doesn't want to be filmed, guys. But you saw what he was running. So that's that. There's no filming. They can hear you, though. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, we're going to cap this up here pretty soon, so if you're going to be doing what you're going to be doing, that's fine. But... Small potatoes. What? <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right, guys, you heard him. He doesn't want to be filmed. So that's that. I'm going to go back in my vehicle, and when he's done the rest of the roll call, he'll be able to wrap it up. I'll stay live as long as I can. See you, Rich. I see you out there, Bill. Kyle, Seth, I'm trying to see who else I can see out there, but uh, it's a nice night to be out here. I'll show you what I'm, I'm not going to hear him as well, although I can hear, but that's me, and I'm running about 111 inches with, uh, just like you, Panty Snatcher, with a stick on, and that's me, so he's got some height. If I would have brought my tornado up, uh, I would have had the same elevation. My ears aren't as good as his, obviously. But he couldn't hear that musical carrier in the beginning. And if you guys were out here, you would have heard the musical carrier, too. So, pros and cons.
No, it's not bleed from 19. There's a carrier in North Jersey. You guys can't hear him down there, Rich. Up here, we're hearing above Allentown. We can hear west to Lancaster. We can hear North Jersey, and we can hear Delaware and down the Jersey Shore, Rich. That's pretty good, huh, Bill? I can hear Wingnut. I can hear KC in his mobile. I'm right here, bud. What's going on? Hey, 751. Yeah. Yeah, it's just, uh, we got a musical carrier in North Jersey. I got I got Yeah, I'm at a 267. You got a grip? Okay, 2012. 2012. I'm on my way. I'll see you. How about a 267? You got a grip? How about a 267? Yeah, quickly. Thank you, Rick. We were playing on the roll call right now. We're on 20. Roger. Hey, you're sounding good up here. Uh, I have some out there. Uh, 27. Yeah, they're on 20. Trying to get a hold of Rick. How about it, Master Blaster? Hey, who's calling the Blaster? Hey, you got a copy on me up on the mountain there, brother. One, two, three, one, two, three. I got a copy, I got a copy. Who is that? My friend, Penny Snatcher? Nah, it's Paul. I talked to you on the, uh, the turnpike a little while ago. Oh, Roger, oh, Roger. Oh, my bad. I thought you were Penny Snatcher uh, up in the stick. Nah, I'm up here with Bear. I'm waiting for him to come back from his break. I hear you, I hear you. How you hearing me on that fiberglass antenna down there? Yeah, uh, you kidding me about it too. I'm on a fiberglass too. I took my beam down the other day. Didn't get it up in time. Roger that. All right, I'll be standing by for the rest of his roll call. Hey, Gregory, Star Wars, got a copy on KC. Star Wars, you hear me? I hear you, KC. Yeah, copy, call, man. I'm making Star Wars on the mountain. I hear you on top of the mountain. You're making the trip. That's not nice, Rick. <laughs> um, KC, you on top of the bridge? Now, Ah, It's by the water department. It's an elevation spot. We have a carrier up here. Uh, let me clear out the channel, man. You want to turn it up a little more?
What kind of red tail you got there right now? It's just an A99, but I have it on a tower, and I got the Lincoln 2 Plus, and that's it, just working bare off of that. Uh, I'm sure you would have said you have pretty good results with that combination too, don't you? Yeah, that's what people tell me when they hear it.
Rare Bear doesn't want to be on camera, guys. Anybody was asking. I went up to his van earlier. He said no, he doesn't want to be on film. What's that? Go ahead, John.
You're welcome. I, I hear a 610. If uh, somebody out there would not be on the key, uh, 610, bring it back. I'm listening. You're welcome, Bill. Glad you're able to copy it from California, brother. I can't keep turning the volume hey, down. I can't keep turning my mobile down when he keys yeah, up. Yeah, that's 610. He's up here in Bethlehem. He's on a striker with a 955 striker with a Antron 99 up on the hill over here in Fountain Hill. Thank you, Sandman. You got it, buddy. Yeah, I hear you now. What are you box all for? What the hell? Saturday night, come on. I hear you, Belly. Yes. Yeah. 
didn't hear you say anything there. I was uh, listening to what you said, and then I was copying the uh, penny snatchers up there where you guys couldn't hear. And by the time I could say anything, the other guys said, I do these other words. That's the hell of it. When you're up here, I can copy two, three, four different stations. I can copy them and listen to them just about at the same time. And who the hell do you pick, you know? Anyway, I am off the key and listening. John, that was... Call me while I'm live, John. I'm going to get you. Quiet up here, but I don't have the base antenna. Okay, uh, does anybody else say they want to do a roll call? Because if not, uh, we can do just a normal chit chat because uh, this is still being recorded. So uh, if you still want the roll call, fine and dandy, I got no problems. Uh, so uh, let me know. How about it, Rare Man? 322 Bucks County, Pennsylvania, waving in there for the roll call. Hello, Mr. 322 in Bucks County. Very loud and clear station. What kind of antenna are you transmitting with tonight? Uh, currently, I have my old Starduster up there at about 42 feet. That thing hasn't fallen down yet? Take it down, Ron. No, uh, that one is still up there. My, uh, my other one that I had up there, that thing fell down, but it's still going. Well, do you buy them used? That's why you keep falling down or what? No, we went a little too much undersizing on the uh, mast that was holding up and it couldn't take the wind load. So uh, we got this one back up there and we're, we're, we're still running it. Oh, uh, boy. <laughs> well, anyway, you sound very good. Clean sounding station for sure. Yeah, thank you very much. You're sounding nice and proud down here also. How far are you from Quakertown? I am a pretty good distance, probably about 25 miles. I'm in Warminster, right at the uh, Willow Grove Air Base area. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. That's where we had a friend named Doug from down there. Yeah, I'm probably about three or four minutes from the airbase right there, so I'm not too far. Well, keep up, keep up the good work with your uh, combo down there, because you sure sound good up here. With that, I'm going to have to turn you loose. We're up there, and I am off the key. All right, thank you very much. You enjoy your evening, sir. Why don't we do a Henry and come back with a rag shoe? What do you think? I think that's an excellent idea. An excellent idea. We have a suggestion on the floor. Let's do a short Henry break. After the Henry break, we can conclude the roll call. And then we go on to a rag shoe session. Anybody in favor of that? Say aye. Uh, huh? Yeah, I have it. Okay. So right now, 
Uh, we are on a very short heavy break, about five minutes, to be exact, to tell you the truth. I am very pumped, and uh, we'll come back and do what we got to do. I am off the key, and that's it. Yo, yo, where you at? How about it there, Mr. Hard Start? You got a copy on 1207? Yes. How about it, Hard Start, 1207? 1207, Hard Start, right back. Sounding good, my friend. I could hear you. I was coming up through the back way, up to 100, and I could hear you talking the whole way up. Great sounding station, my friend. I never lost you once. Hey, 1207, we definitely appreciate the flowers. Well, we've got her in weekend mode, but you know how it goes. So I don't want to clog up the airways, and I'm going to step wide to the side. We'll probably catch you when you get back to your 20. Copy that. Speaking of my 20, real quick, I wanted to know if, uh, is Valley Girl, Valley Girl, are you out there listening, break? How about it, Valley Girl, you got a copy? Uh, she's probably watching the Flyers game. All right, I'm 10-6. Anybody listening that can hear me, this is being broadcast live on Facebook Live on the Quad State page. And when we wrap it up, the video will be available to everybody on Quad State. If you know how to use a YouTube downloader, you should be able to download the video. Thank you, Star Wars. Star Wars is the man. Our man, Star Wars. Thank you, Paul. Thank you. Copy that, gentlemen. I'm on the side. Break, Shadow. Go, Break. Thank you. About a hard start. About a hard start. Your night train base station waving at you. Night train. Night train base station out of Potsdam. I'm going to leave the audio running. I got to try to get out of this car a second, guys. Uh, you know, I have to try, man. It's been a long time. <laughs> it's nice to hear you, man, and you sound just as good or better than what you did before, did it, Tim? Uh, we appreciate those flowers, big brother. We definitely appreciate them. I heard you check in on the roll call, and I had it in my head. I was going to try to yell at you, uh, you know, after everybody got out of the way. But you beat me to it. Sounding good in my radio. Roger, Roger. Yeah, I um, was kind of just sitting by the radio listening to Rare Bear and seeing how many of the constituents that I could actually hear, which I didn't do too bad, but some of them I did not receive at all. <laughs> but you come to here like gangbusters, so I think I better holler before I lose you there, Temple. Roger, yeah, I um, was kind of just sitting by the radio listening to that I could actually hear. Wow, that's beautiful. Rev, um, was that you, Hard Star? Did you record that? Yes, sir. That's on my radio. Heard, my friend. 10-8 and straight. Well, that's nice. Uh, I'm not complaining about that at all. Doesn't sound as good as you, but I'm, I'm happy. This is without the lights. Those lights you see up there are the stars. Waiting for Panty Snatcher to come on and anybody else. I'll keep staying live until they kick me off. So even though he does the rag chew, I'll stay live. How about that uh, station calling night train? Come on. Hello, Hey, what's going on, Edward? <laughs> Sound real good, man. What you doing here with me? I hear you running, my friend. That's good. How's everything going for you? All right, man. I haven't heard nothing from the other fellow, Roger. Yeah, somehow or another, man, I think things went south on us there. You know, without any further information. Turn for it. Oh, damn. Yeah, I, I just don't know what the situation is or was, but 
I'm pretty sure that uh, he would have gotten with us if it was possible, Roger. Well, it's good to hear you, Hammer. I heard you the other night, man, but uh, you came and went. I was in sandbag mode, Roger. Roger, Roger. 336. Take care up there. 135, we're leaving. 10 Roger, 135, the night train base station, and we're back on the side. Hey, the roll call is resuming as of right now. Anybody out there that hasn't had your hand raised on this, uh, Clark State Radio Radio, uh, uh, roll call tonight, hello? Time night train 1207 up on a hill. Hello there, 1207. How are you doing, man? I ain't talked to you in a while. I think the last time I spoke to you, I was up here and I talked to you all the way 
down a street road in 95, what, about 2.30 in the morning. He certainly did. And for the life of me, I know you got a galactic type handle, but I'm trying to think, what was it? Star Wars. There it is, see? I'm not too far off the mark. How are you sounding up there, man? Bodacious. You always sound good. It's, it's been a minute, but yeah, we haven't spoken in a while. And I always uh, hunt and peck for you fellas, but it's uh, it's the ground noise coming underneath my antenna down there. But you're sounding good, my friend. You sound good. Pleasure's all mine. Tim Roger there, Star Wars. It's definitely a pleasure, man, and it's nice to hear you. All right, I'm going to stop aside. I hear voices out there. I don't want to tie it up. There's your train station, Pottstown. I'm back quiet. 1207-106. Copy in a mail. 1206, uh, you got a copy, 327, John, out of Bethlehem. Hello, 327, 1207, uh, I can hear you just fine. Uh, 1207, yeah, I was wondering what hill you're on. I'm up here in, uh, I'm in the valley up here, the Valley, uh, kind of down in the hole, but, uh, 1207, what hill are you on? I'm, uh, I'm sitting, uh, beside Rare Bear. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, you're, uh, south of me then, a little ways, for sure. All righty. Thank you for the comeback. You sound very good up here. You got a nice forward swing going on. Copy that, my friend. Thank you so much. Sounding good. I'm going to take a standby and let the channel roll. All right. Same on this end. Bye now. At 1207, Jimmy here. A Hello, out there. Good evening, Roger. What's it all? Sound working? Working. I heard somebody call me in the distance. Go ahead. Yeah, it's King Cut. We're at the breakfast today. Uh, somebody was looking for you. Copy that there, King Tut. Waving the hand back at you. Have you heard River Rat? I can hear him. Yeah, Tom, I said hi. I saw him today at the breakfast. Clear, I'll be back. Hello, King Todd. Night train waving. Hi, bro. Don't be too... Hey, Night train. Radio standing good. Roger, Roger. You hold the first down. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Tim Roger, King Todd. I'm back on the side. Start waving right back. Hello, 1207. Jimmy here. Hey, good evening, JB. I hear you good, John. 10-4. All right, man. Thank you. Copy that. All right, let me let uh, let me let these guys get in on their rag chew. I don't want to tie the channel up. Hello, JB. Night train. Just saying hello.
a few, uh, couple of fiberglass here and there, and, but uh, I don't like them up in the air. To be honest, I think they attract lightning worse than the uh, aluminum ones do, but that's just me. Titan yeah, 4, yeah, yeah, nothing like some aluminum. If, if, and even when it's noisy down here, I still think that the metal's quieter. That's what the guys up here say. They've, they've told me that for years, and I finally got all aluminum. Because, I mean, the reflector uh, on this PDL-2 is, uh, it has fiberglass radios, but there's a copper wire that runs around it, you know, because it's a quad. Yeah, certainly. Yeah, I'm kind of familiar with them. At uh, one time, we were contemplating before the uh, hula hoops went up, and, and then that turned into a catastrophe. But anyhow, here we are on the Mako store bar. Hey, Roger, well, it's definitely doing the job. Uh, I, I think that this is the best that I've heard you, you know I mean? In other words, we can just communicate. We don't have to holler or nothing. Yeah, maybe a little bit of his conditions. Uh, Cause back in the day, I seen you remember when we went flat. Uh, that really brought us up. But I can't do that right now. Roger that. Well, trust me when I tell you this. I got a little bit over six on you. Time for it. Well, that's about right. I'll, I'll tell you what. Just a hard seven. A little forward swing, but I got a full seven S units on my friend the night train. Roger that. Yeah, so we're doing our thing. All right, I'm gonna step aside. I want to tie it up. There's the train station number 336. They call me Mr. Night Train. Your knight in shining armor, and I'm back quiet. All right, big brother, 926, the hard start in Williamstown. We're not as good as that old night train up there, but we just do the best we can with what we got. <laughs> you flatter me, man. I think we scared them off with this smooth talking radio and stuff. You got it, Billy. I don't know, man. They got quiet. They must still be on break. Bigger. I imagine 1207 is probably sliding down off that hill by now. Nah, I'm sitting up here. Uh, we're just, uh, they're, they're, they're chewing the rag and uh, we're just copying the mail. Staying live on Facebook, uh, as long as people are out here, uh, I'll, I'll stay live on Facebook so folks can hear each other. Oh, copy. I didn't even hear them. I, maybe they went to another channel, but when my train and I was chatting, I didn't hear them in there. I hope I didn't get in their way. That rare bear's still up there. They're, uh, they're sitting back chewing the rag themselves. Oh, I bought a ranch you all in one. How about that? <laughs> well, this modern technology is taking it to another level. Is the recording taking place from up there at 1207? Yeah, yeah, I'm live. Uh, I'm live right behind uh, Rare Bear. Are you on Facebook? I have it, but I don't know how to use it. Like, you know, I guess, I, I guess at some point I'm going to learn. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'll make it once I save the video. It's live now, but I'll make it. Uh, it's public, so anybody who wants to see it can see it. All right, let us know when it's public. I'm gonna stand by. Somebody's hollering. Train on the side. Go ahead, break. and that Vector 4000 on the back of that truck. He's been sounding good lately. His receiver is good, too. If it wasn't so late, I'd run up that, that mountain a mile uh, an hour from here. I'd run up and meet him, but uh, it's a little too late to be traveling up there. Yeah, especially with this weather coming in. 
Yeah, we got some rain coming in tomorrow morning, I think around 10, 11 o'clock. So right now, but then they said heavy winds. So I don't know. This is probably the best night we could add. No skip. Clear conditions. Ranger 20 for a radio check. I'm not what you're saying, man. I'm not a Sam man. Twelve oh seven, was that Sam man that was just talking to you? I'm not sure. I heard somebody ask for a radio check. I thought you were going to pick him up. I did hear him. Uh, I just thought that uh, the guy you was talking to was Sam man. I was just to say hello before you got out of here. A radio check. Go ahead. That person looking for a radio check, come on. Hey, this is Papa Wolf on top of Doe Mountain, Pennsylvania. You're reaching for the world. Anybody got a copy out there? You're in Doe Mountain? Did you say you're on Doe Mountain? What's your 20? How far out are you? Just north of Pottstown. Oh, there you go, there you go. Yeah, I'm up here by Bear Creek, if you know where that's at. Not, but I'm hearing you just fine. We're waiting for Panty Snatcher. He's up there near the Pocono Mountains. Bear Creek is up near Wilkesbury, isn't it? Is that Bear Creek up near Wilkesbury, sir? Negative, negative. Oh. It's, uh, you know where Herford is? Rare Bear, do you hear him? I'll fall for Route 100. Copy that, copy that. Yeah, that's why I'm going to stay live, let everybody uh, take a peek, and when we wrap it up, it'll be available from start to finish. Sorry to scare me, man. Yeah, I, I talked to a guy named Ranger a couple of times down there near Pottstown and whatnot. All right, I hear you in the, uh, the, the, you're up there at the mountain, and uh, I can hear the fellows in Jersey. I'm going to take a standby, because uh, there's two different conversations going on. I heard your hard start. The whole video will be available when we do wrap it up. It'll it'll publish up there and stay up there. How are you supposed to sound? This is weird. Same radio as yours. Look familiar. Same one you got in your mobile. Hard start. That's the same radio you got in your truck there, uh, hard start. You know what I'm about? You go over here and hear it sometimes. Sound like hot sauce out there. Hot sauce. Rare bear in a mobile. How about it? Hot sauce. I like that hot sauce down here at Newcastle. Come on, hot sauce. I hear that mobile down there. Let it rip. Hey, real, real, man. Hey, real, real, man. I, I just saw Facebook. I was kind of listening to something, so I said this is the life here, folks, man. Oh, I hear yeah, that I like do for sure. Hey, you're sounding good tonight for sure. For a change. How long you had that radio you're talking on right now? Uh, well, I'm talking on an old Magnum S3, man. I want a Magnum S3 here. Hold that. Uh, you ain't blowed that one up yet? Oh, you say you haven't blown that one up yet? You know what? I'm listening to two things. I'm listening to real people. I understand. Okay, hey, hot sauce. 
get good conversing with you. And uh, you can get back to your Facebook. Uh, you don't have to mess with me over here then. I'm, uh, I'm going to take a standby for right now. Catch you later for sure. I am off the key. Hey, we're out here. You got a good copy. You got a good copy. Yes, I have a very good copy. You're only about seven bars up here, but uh, too much echo, you're hard to understand, but that's the way you run your equipment. Yeah, very strong signal. All right, good, really, really, I appreciate it, man. I appreciate it, I could make the trip up the other day. You take care, man, most of all, be safe. Real, real hot sauce is sick in the mail. Bye-bye. Hot sauce, you got a grip on 1207? How about it, Hot Sauce in Delaware, 1207? He's not going to hear me. How about it, Hot Sauce? How about it, Hot Sauce, Night Train, Bay Station, Pottstown? Hey, Hot Sauce, Night Train, Bay Station, Pottstown, waving. I think he's listening to the, the, the computer. Hey, Hot Sauce, are you running that four-element beam, or do you want the, uh, the other antenna? He's not focused tonight. on a young key. Rare Bear, I'd like to get it back to my home base for one second. I'm going to try to get it back to my base real quick there, Rare Bear. Bye-bye. 
Yep, I just wanted to see if I could hear you, Valley Girl. You got a copy? How about it, Valley Girl? You got a copy? Oh, you got a copy. I got a copy on you. I don't think you're hearing me, though. I don't think she's hearing me. No contact on Valley Girl. Thanks for the break, guys. Is that your wife? Yeah, but she can't hear me. Just let her know. Tell her, say, I, I, I can hear her, but she can't hear me. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> you want me to tell Lady Star Wars that you're all right? Ain't hey, nobody home, whatever the hell you get there. Is that what you say? Is that what you want me to tell her? No. <laughs> she'll, she'll be, she'll, she's just, I just wanted to hear if she could hear me. She can't hear me up here. It's just the position I'm parked in. It ain't convenient for you that she can't hear what you're saying, but I can. <laughs> but anyway, uh, Lady Star Wars, are you out there? This is Rare Bear. I'm parked alongside of uh, your uh, uh, husband. I hear her fine. She cannot hear me. Oh, oh, I see. I understand. That's my base. I know that gets out. <laughs> yeah, Breger. <laughs> I'm on the side, Rare Bear. Yeah, Breger. Well, Breger. Smoke panty snatcher. Crystal clear. The feet point, the feet point of this antenna is over 2300 feet. Panty snatcher, Pennsylvania mobile, standing by. Good evening, time panty snatcher, 1207 in the mobile. Okay, hello, 1207. I gotta catch my breath here. Ten four, you're booming up to seven to eight pounds over here. Sound real good, my friend. Sound good. More like some duct tape. Chelsea's a bad look for all yous. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I hear you there, uh, hot sauce. Hot sauce, hot sauce. Hot sauce, Delaware. Twelve oh seven with the wave. Golly, Mr. 
Fish Molly. That's all I got to say. Hi, Mr. Hot Sauce, I appreciate that. Mr. Hot Sauce, Newcastle, Delaware, 1207. High atop Rare Bear Mountain, and I'm back quiet. Bye, 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 bye. Bye, 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 bye. Blowing smoke, ain't no joke. Yeah, not that I want to get rid of though. Now, Panty Snatcher's up on the hill, you heard him. He's got a Vector 4000 like I used to have in the yard on the back of his truck. He's, he's friggin' up there, man. He's up there. Anybody who talks on Channel 28 knows who he is. At least 2,200. At least 2,200. Okay, maybe a couple inches, too. That's what she said. Yeah, don't worry about it. He's still trying to get comfortable. That's a whole lot of duck looking height there for sure. That's nice, nice, nice height. Nice height. I hear you, Kyle. Well, how about that panty snatcher? He's 2,200 feet, and he and the vector, the vector is 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 uh is not 100 feet. Hey, good evening, time to you. Old Jr. Boyertown saying hello. Hello, Jr. What three five, Raven? Hey, one, three, five, boy, you're sounding good tonight. As you always do. I never heard you sound bad. Right here, right here, man. Take care, buddy. All right, you take care, 135. I hear you, Kyle. I, I've mapped it out to the elevation. I'm just saying, he can't be 100 feet higher than, the, than where it's at with the antenna. You follow? You can't add 100 feet with the antenna. <laughs> He doesn't have 100 feet of antenna. That's all I'm saying. He's at 22, probably 2250. I'll give him that. Sure is quiet out there. Well, the ice star, you still with us? What's the sea level? What's the sea level you got up here? Yes, we're still here. Ice I just got a text. From Renegade out of his campsite. He said he copied me ranking Quad State and making the next roll call west of Harrisburg. He couldn't, he, he couldn't uh, get it back because the receiving transmit is going in and out wherever he is. Oh, copy that. Well, okay. I, as a matter of fact, I just sent you a short video. I didn't even know Renegade was in the game. Nah, he said he was going to give it a try uh, around 10 15 or so, and he didn't. And I called, and he said his cell service is bad, and the radio, too. And uh, that, that was it, so I didn't know any more about it. 
uh, copy that. Well, I sent you like a six or seven second video of what I'm seeing down here with Star Wars and all that stuff. It's actually looking pretty good. I just heard myself on uh, Star Wars uh, Star Wars download onto the web page. That doesn't sound too bad. You sound great. <laughs> I heard you the whole way up. I told you. I never lost you. That three element Mako is working. Maybe the next time I come up hard start off. I'll bring the hard start. I'll bring my my uh, tornado up. Copy that. You know the damn just thing? Hot sauce can't hear me. I've tried a hundred times to get to him and he cannot hear me. Can you believe that? <laughs> These are both watching on Facebook. Same amount of that. Maybe I'll bring the tornado with twenty feet of cable and uh ten ten fifteen foot of mast. Put the tornado up. I'll be able to hear as well as Rare Bear then. And Seth's got a base antenna on the back of his truck. And Rare Bear will be... Hey, hi, it's Scott. Hey, hi, it's Scott. I'm listening to Facebook. I'm listening to you. <laughs> you guys are answering each other over the air watching yourself on the video. There you go, hi, Scott. Man says he's copying you now. He, he got the peanut butter out of his ears now. Yeah, he said he's copying me on the Facebook page. He's copying me off the Facebook page, not off the radio. Oh shit, that don't count. <laughs> He's still got the skippy, the uh, peanut butter, the crunchy, the plain, the creamy. He's still got all that shit. <laughs> oh shit, he was an excuse! <laughs> oh yeah, I got out of that. Skippy! <laughs> 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 I'm trying to pick on you, don't you know that? Hey, hard start, I'm here to drop in. I'm here dropping on Facebook on you, man. I can't talk to you on the radio, but I could hear you on Facebook for sure. <laughs> I'm... Yeah, that's crazy, because that radio's hearing me up on the hills about 65 miles from me, <laughs> and you can't hear me across the river. Go figure. I'm rolling a nickel through the video. Yeah, you is, and you're doing it well. Hey, I right, I know you're talking, man, but it's, it's kind of hard for me to pull off what you're saying. It's not like I can't hear you any at all, but it's just hard for me to uh, pull off what you're saying there, Photon.
See if I get a get a better better receive on him. Turning it around. Oh damn, Royal Farrell was bagging. I didn't know that. Now he's going to turn me stealing again. I got my eye on you. Check your mailbox. You'll get all them damn speeding tickets. Oh, you got some hard work in all the radio too. Uh, yeah, he'll probably just throw in the trash anyway. How about a panty snatcher? Yes, go ahead. Yeah, I turned the house, I turned the car around. Getting a better grip on you, man. I don't know if you're hearing me any better. Uh, we don't take touch before. I talked to you before, I was on the, uh, on the stick on the antenna, and I'm on the vector. Yeah, I said I turned, I turned my car the other way to see if I could hear you better. Yeah, I heard that, but then you said, then you just said, I don't know if it's any better for me up here. I said, I don't know, I wasn't paying attention when I had the magnet on before. Ah, oh, come on now. Why weren't you paying attention? It's being rushed. <laughs> he was getting comfortable. He told me he's so broke he can't even pay attention. Well, we gotta jerk off and feed the cat, what the hell? I'm going to stick on it. 
Snatcher, Snatcher, Snatcher. I'm looking north now, Snatcher. What am I giving you on that braggedy ass mobile and that two pill 1207 barefoot? Break, break. S5, no swing, no nothing, just an S5. Foten, brother, Foten. Sounding good. You and that vector with that two pill, and I'm back quiet. Yeah, look, can you hear me now? Hey, what's going on?
Not much, just jumped down here for a minute, was up on 27, went up there, hit the roll call, and uh, heard you. Had him jump in here and say, uh, you know, top of the night. Yeah, appreciate that, big brother. Good job. Sounded good, man. I'm, uh, like I was just telling the 2012 there, I'm sitting up here by the uh, Pocono NASCAR Raceway up here at Long Pond, and, uh, um, well, the vehicle's at 22, a little over 2,200 feet. The antenna's sitting over 2,300 feet right about now to break yeah, you're doing it. I'm, uh, I took the beam down to do some stuff to it, so I'm on a, uh, uh IMAX 2000 right now. It's working good. I'm, uh, I got a Vector 4000 set up on the back of this mobile air brake. Ah, them vectors are bad, no doubt. I had one up before I put the beam up, but I was bleeding the neighbor, so I went the other way out. Hey, tough word. Ah, man, I appreciate it. I'm stand by see what else is out there. I mean, this mobile air rocking the mail. Roger, you have yourself a uh, good evening, and I'll talk to you before the holidays. This is me reading on this Barefoot radio right now. It's Barefoot. I'm going to turn the box on now. Uh, tell me the difference between the two, hello. Well, there, Barry, you were giving me a three with no box and jumped up to a nine with a box over here in Horsham. So I have Penny Stacks. Thank you very much, Horsham. We're from the seven to an eight in my radio. Go ahead, go barefoot right now, and then do it again. All right, this is barefoot right now on the barefoot side. Got the amplifier on right now, hello. Rare Bear 2012, what a win. I'm out of Paris, Snatcher. It's coming your way. Do it again, I double key with you. You'll, you'll see it for yourself, I just sent a video to you. Careful. But it, it was a, uh, it was just under a five when it turned on. It was a seven with a little bit of four. It was under a 29 here. Clever. Well, I saw, I was about a seven, and then I went to a heavy eight when he turned it on. Hey, hard start, what am I giving you down there just out of curiosity? Hey, hard start. What am I giving you down there in Williamstown? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, you're right around this section. You got me at six. Copy that. Yeah, I was just curious. It's a, uh, it's a difference in elevation. He's got a base station antenna, and I'm running 111 inches of steel. So, but yeah, just curious. I appreciate it, my friend. Seventy thirds. I'm back quiet. Maybe he would like me to take my big antenna down and just point my magical striker magnum out antenna. What do you think? Is that, is that what it's coming to? I you hear you. Snatcher. My son lives down in Glen Burnie. That's a two-hour ride south of here. Glen Burnie, Maryland. I actually pulled in a pro-am down there and met Earl Anthony. How about that? <laughs> I 
that's a good ride there once you come out through the tunnel. You guys still on the mountain? Yep, we're still on the mountain. Hey, 10 4 is that Star Wars? Uh, Red Baron say hello. Hey, Red Baron, top of the evening to you. Yeah, and Seth, uh, Panty Snatcher's up there. He's at 20, 2,600 feet or something like that, 2,300 feet. Uh, he's, uh, he's at about an hour north of us. Yeah, he always blows in here. He always blows in here no matter where he's at. Uh, he probably can't hear me. I'm only one of 12 watts lately. He's got good ears. He's got good ears if he's here in Maryland. 810-4. Hey, How about my left-handed coffee drinker? How about my left-handed coffee drinking brother? I hear you. Hey, how you doing, Hard Start? Tipping my hat to you this evening. How you doing? We got our we, we went and cut our tree down today. I got the tree is cruising around under it. I got the little, little village lit up. We didn't we didn't we didn't put the lights on the tree yet though. We'll get to that later. We'll do that during a rainstorm tomorrow. You all set up over there ready for Christmas? Yeah, about as set up as we could be with the with the cast and stuff like that. We kind of went back to the ceramic, but anyhow, I heard you in there. Wanted to make sure I got my face in your place and said howdy, howdy. Hey, Ted, I'm gonna get out of the way. I'm gonna get out of the way. All right, gentlemen, have a pleasant evening. We'll catch you all another time. All right, Red Bear, we appreciate the get back. Nine two six out of the way. Catch you later, Red Baron, old JR saying hello. Hey, JR, how you doing? We're waving right back at you. Have a great evening yourself, uh, my friend. Everybody try to stay dry tomorrow. It's supposed to be a doozy. Yeah, good day to stay indoors. That's what we're going to be doing. All right, Red Baron, not going to hold it there, but uh, just heard you in there wanted to say hey. Take it easy, Red Baron. All right, gentlemen, take care. Hey, King Tut, drop down to 17. Go for Sounds good, good, good audio. I, mean, I don't think these other guys have a river, but uh, yeah, 
ماشي ده بالجواز He's probably only going to hear Rare Bear. He's probably getting off of Route 55 and 322 right about now. You, John? Yeah, there's somebody out there waiting. This is yelling for me, man, but you're right there in my 
my static. Uh, so I said, do you not hear you out there? This is uh, yellow for me, but you're right there with my static level. I can't even know what you're saying, Danny. He says you're with the way right back, though. I heard you, John.
Funky. 1207 with the wave. Try it again, Funky. Try it again. I'm doing good, brother. You sound real good. You sound good up here, man. I'm sitting right behind Rare Bear. Copy that, copy that. All right, man, I'll talk to you later. Go Eagles. <laughs> Go Eagles. I'll see you later. <laughs> I saw your shit on Facebook. Don't start. You got your, you got your spoon in the pot. Funky, you got your first your spoon in the pot. I know what you're doing. <laughs> Alright, Funky, let me let you go. Somebody's been trying to put them all on you since you keyed up. But they, it ain't working, man. You're still getting over them. I'll talk to you later, Funky. I'll see you on Facebook. Whoever's trying to put them all on Funky, you better buy another radio because it ain't working. I'm gone. They, they with the haters club, man. They, they, they with the haters club, Funky. What are you gonna do? <laughs> I know you talk on six. All right, man. Seventy thirds, my friend. Take care, Mr. Funky Ground Plane. Your friend, twelve oh seven on a mountain. I'm back quiet. Let's go, Eagles. Listen. I always tell you guys like football. Go ahead, Funky. You're 10 7. Bye. <laughs> All right, people, see what you like to watch. This is how it is. Eagles play football. Just facts are facts. Yeah, you know, you know, you know, you know.
the show man bun. I'm sure we gotta go and pull it back. Just me and this mobile way up here. I mean, way up here on the north side. Got down. The mobile smoking. Pull the audio back just a little bit. Turn my chair. Turn it back. Well, turn it back a little bit. You're, you're just blaring. It's hard. It's uh, hard to use. You don't need it all. All right, one second here. Well, not the wind. sound good because he doesn't. He got peanut butter in your ears. He's going to turn it back. Watch, you're going to be a lot clearer. He got them real big. Got them. All right, he's going back here, right about here, right about now. Break it, break it. As long as you don't get excited and start screaming into it, that's acceptable, but it should be a little bit more of it, whatever. Hey, Snatcher, what kind of mic you got? Bounds down there, is that what you said? Yeah, if you give me seven, and you're driving a little bit past a nine, but it, it sounds good to me. Oh, uh, you said it's ringing nine, is that correct? Yeah, well, well, uh, uh, well, 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 I think you're being a little arrogant, because you're giving me about a ten, and driving now uh, close to a twenty. What kind of mic you running, Panty Snatcher? I've got I can't on the foot. Uh, that's we're trying to figure it out. I'm, I'm sitting up here at twenty three hundred feet, which is we're trying to figure things out, that's all. What kind of microphone you got, Panty Snatcher? Not that damn way up there. I'm telling him how good you feel. I want to know what kind of radio you're on. I don't care about the feet. What kind of radio and mic is that? Me? I'm just on a twenty nine classes with a six thirty six of static, that's it. Superstar microphone, that'll clear everything up. Alright fellas, I'm wrapping it up man. It'll take me an over an hour to get home. Thanks for watching guys. Take care.